Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the Tiger Financial News Network, 9 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network update. And we're looking at the Dow unchanged at 33,016 after a really sharp upside move yesterday. Um, just a, a kind of a, a, a combination of a relief rally, plus some buying, a lot of short covering. And we'll see what happens today. We'll talk about that in the next show coming up, which is the... Uh, Morning market kickoff with Tommy O'Brien, but Tommy's not here. I'll be I'll be subbing for him. Then I'll do my show at, at uh, ten o'clock. We're looking at uh, the S and P. This is the I'll go to the e, the E mini right now. <clears throat> e mini is up five at forty one ninety one. It was a very good session yesterday, but on the chart, just looking at it visually, it should really have gone a little bit higher. We'll see what happens today. I believe that this was a low and not the low. We'll talk about that as well. The QQQ, that's the index 100. Let me go to the NQs for the moment. NQ trading down 275 at 14,400. Also, a pretty good session yesterday, but uh, it has to have follow through and needs to climb above the 14,531 200-period moving average in the next couple of days. Looking at the uh, IWM, that's the Russell 2000. I'll go to the actual IWM because that's trading pre-market up 59 cents at 163.70. That has been struggling. It is on the verge of breaking key support from uh, earlier this year, making this arch formation. You're going to watch this one very closely. Now, here's the issue. Gold gold is, uh, is down a dollar at 2004. It's had a spectacular run, and the, the gold stocks are not actually participating as well. Some are, but the majority are not. So we'll be watching this because the dollar is pulling back a little bit. The dollar is down 4 ticks, uh, 0.03 at 106.11. It's not breaking down, but it's really close to seeing the nine period moving average possibly turn negative. We're going to be watching that. Uh, we're going to go to the bonds. Now, this is going to be very important. Bonds were up about a point and something. Now they're up 18, 30 seconds, about a half a point. At 109, 27, 30 seconds. They're in a sideways move. Can the bonds, can the TLT, that's the Lehman 20 at Treasury Bond Fund, push much higher here so that yields could come down? And crude oil right now, crude oil is up 82 cents. I'll be back. For the morning market kickoff show, Tommy O'Brien's not here. I'll be subbing for that hour. Basil Chapman, looking forward to seeing you in a few moments.